Welcome to our EQ Lighting Application Suite video series. In this video I will show you a very helpful tool to preview your show, especially if you are working with media walls to display effects or other complex shows. Let us build a little show using a predefined patch file and we will use a not so complex show which runs with four lines and four rows of 64 pixel boards. So I select this and I import the patch. I use the first channel and with the right mouse button use all. So I'm using all the fixtures. To make it easier I use the live effects engine to create a little show I add an effect. I use a predefined effect. Well, let's call it, I would take this Y to blow it, go out in Y warp. So in the preview window you now see this show. With the mouse wheel I can scroll in and this is our show. The disadvantage is that my display is not very performant. So what you see is not a real view of what is happening on the media wall and for this we can better use an additional tool in the lighting application suite. Let me close it first and then we will call this additional tool. Imagine is a separate component in the lighting application suite beside the programmer and with Imagine I can preview my show in much more detail and much more speed because it is direct X based. To use Imagine we first have to add a driver. So I open the device manager, add a driver and I use the 3D visualizer Imagine. And now I add the driver for Imagine. The driver is enabled, it has a private logbook, this is this part. So that's everything is fine. The searching because it is not finding the Imagine. I have to start Imagine manually first. For example, from the Windows system manual. And here now is Imagine running. I will resize the window a little bit so it fits in our view. The programmer and Imagine are two separate programs and they could even run on two separate systems. Here now they are running on one system and they are communicating over the Ethernet interface. For this reason they have to know each other. Uh, I click on the Imagine Extras menu entry and the application options and I tell it to use this interface as an interface to the programmer. Okay. But also the programmer has to know the location of the Imagine program running. And you see it's looking for address which ends up in one. But as it is running on the same system as the programmer, I use the same address. And now the programmer finds Imagine and uses Imagine for displaying the show. So I will bring back Imagine and here now you can see our show running in Imagine. And in this Imagine display you can zoom in, for example, with the keyboard buttons W, you can shift down with S and up and turn left and turn right. As Imagine is running in with DirectX, it's much faster than the usual preview window which, are use, which is used in the programmer. And you can even preview very, very complex projects in real time, how this looks like in your real installation.